Jimmy Lennon Jr. Sean, in many times in the showtime, it says it's showtime, and it certainly is showtime for Malloy here in Leisureland. They touch gloves. The main event of the evening, and welcome to those of us, people listening to us on Gold of AFM on radio, on Gold of AFM.ie, on ESPN Sport. Here we go for eight rounds of boxing. Fernando Mascara from Colombia as Kira Malloy comes forward with that southpaw stance on the first right. Jab goes out from Malloy. Lunging right hand from Mosquera who with the white gloves, white trunks trimmed with the Colombian flag. A much stockier opponent than Malloy. Malloy gets forward. Mosquera tries to come forward with the white gloves. Malloy leads with a right hand over towards the blue corner area of the ring. From our commentary position here in the centre of the ring, we look out at Malloy. Back to us. Stalks his opponent. The crowd waiting in anticipation as Malloy goes forward with a right hand. Mosquera, Stocky, backs back into the neutral corner on the far side of the ring. Tries a jab out and looks to, to, to try a jab out of left hand. Doesn't go. Malloy is stalking his man into the corner. Referee watching David Irwin watching attentively as Malloy lands a little left hand. Doesn't really trouble the Colombian, but Malloy goes over the top of the right hand. The Colombian tries to make out that he hit him with the back of the head. I don't know what he was watching. Once again, leading with the right hand, Kieran Malloy, focused. The Colombian comes forward, Mosquera comes forward, told to keep his head up by the referee David Irwin. As we reach a minute and 20 seconds in round number one, the Colombian tangles up and Malloy slips away and goes back to the centre of the ring and takes control of the opening round. Kieran Malloy with an undefeated record of 4 and 0. Here in his first fight in his native Galway as a professional, Mosquera comes forward with a long right hand, tries to land on the jaw of Malloy, but Malloy slips it away. Malloy coming forward, southpaw stance, right front. Front, on the right front foot, right hand, right above us here in the neutral corner. Malloy goes over the top, Mosquera looks at him, sits him down, Mosquera trying to move around the ring, force Malloy onto him, Malloy hasn't backed into his own corner now over on the far side of the ring, that of course is the blue corner, in that corner is the Malloy team, and they applaud as Malloy lands with a right and a left. Crowd beginning to get excited here as we go into the final minute of the opening round. Kira Malloy, a left that lands on the arm of Fernando Mosquera. Mosquera comes with a right hand, Malloy retaliates with a right hand of his own. Centre of the ring, Mosquera backing back on towards the ropes. Malloy 
as always, even in his amateur days. Cautious in the opening round. Stalks out his man. Lands a short, sharp left hand to the face of Fernando Mosquera. Malloy takes the ribs out of Mosquera with a lovely right hand shot. Mosquera comes forward to tie up his opponent. Malloy tries to wangle his way out. The referee, David Irwin, steps in. Tells Mosquera not to be holding. Mosquera looks back at, Mo- at the referee. And Malloy lands a right hand to the side of the face of Fernando Masquera. Another right hand is that jab, that right jab of Malloy is now beginning to find its range. As we go deep into the final minute, we're into the final 10 seconds of round number one here in Leisureland. The first pro boxing event, the top of the bill. For the first time in over 15 years, we have a pro boxing bill here in Galway. And Kieran Malloy has got through his first round as a professional boxer here in Galway in his fifth fight. An excellent opening round, Sean. So, yeah, yeah, we're getting ready for round number two. Round number two of a scheduled eight at welterweight as Kieran Malloy from Uktarard against Fernando Masquera from Colombia in South America by way of Valencia in Spain. Take us into the second round at welterweight. The top of the bill fight on this Conlon boxing bill in association with top ranked promotions and bar seven here in Galway. Kieran Malloy. Masquera with the left hand. Malloy. Quietly, quietly going about his business. Leads with the right hand onto the glove of Mosquera. Gets him backed into Mosquera's own corner. That is the red corner right in front of us here. Malloy lands with a good right hand. Mosquera ducks away as Malloy stalks his prey in the corner. Mosquera, as Sean said, slightly shorter man. Very sharp comes up, but Malloy connected there to the chin of Mosquera and he did take a step backwards. He's on the ropes for Malloy. Steps back again. South Paul lead as always, but square over the top, trying to catch the Malloy top, yeah. on the top of the head. Didn't really do any damage to Malloy, who now steps away. Malloy, very, very focused right in front of us here with the maroon togs, emblazoned with all his advertising. And of course, when Square goes Just down, it was a slip more than anything, yeah, yeah. I would think. Just the referee slip. asked Square, is he okay? He certainly is. I would put that down to a slip, as you said, Sean. Yeah, well, with Kieran being South Paul and he orthodox, their feet are going, going to clash. They're going to have a clash. Well, Square yeah. came forward again here. He seems to be, he's upper, he's very strong upper body must be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good big arms on him there. And uh, he, he's a good guard, you know, when he goes behind it because of the size yeah. of his arms. And he said, and as we said, he had a lengthy amateur career also. But Kieran Malloy, the crowd now beginning to go behind Malloy. In round number two, he's must square a good. People bring into the fields of Athen It's a fair distance if you're walking from Athen Rye, took the third, but still. The crowd are in good form, and why wouldn't they? They've seen some tremendous fights here tonight, including that Irish light heavyweight title. But this is the main event of the evening as we step in towards a minute and 52 seconds of round number two here in Leisureland. Kieran Malloy from up to third, a tremendous, a tremendous combination, a right left combination to the side of the head of Fernando Masquera, who's on the ropes midway through the ropes, the far side of the ring between Malloy's corner and the neutral nice corner on our left side. Malloy, there. Malloy, a lift to the body as Sean said. Mosquera covers up. He backs out of the ropes with those white gloves. He attempts to come forward, but Malloy is stalking his prey and comes forward with a sh- short jab, southpaw jab into the chest of goes with a left hand, doesn't really land. Mosquera is now backed into the neutral corner where Malloy goes to the work to the body. It was a good shot for Malloy. Mosquera did react. Malloy goes in short again and lands in the, the head of Mosquera. Mosquera invites him onto him. I think that's not the wisest thing you could do in a fight like this. No, but he's happy to take them on the arms as well, George, he, and he, he shortens is. his body as well to take the he body shots. He certainly does. Yeah. He certainly does. Malloy, though, with that South Paul lead. Boxing into the corner, occupied by the team and medical men and coaches of Fernando Masquera. We're into the final 10 seconds of round number two. And Kieran Malloy, a nice left hand from Kieran Malloy, Steps just stops a little yeah. short. Another comfortable round. As the, re- the referee calls a halt to round number two, Sean. <laughs> he was rotating the, other, the shoulders there as he came out. As the referee calls them together for round number three. Round number three of eight for this welterweight contest that tops the bill here in the Conlon Boxing top-ranked promotion in association with the Bar 7 in Galway here in Leisureland. The seventh of seven very exciting fights here tonight in yeah. Leisureland. Mosquera was wild there with a right hand. Malloy slipped away. Malloy comes forward with a good left hand. Rocks rock, rock, Mosquera onto the ropes. Right above us here in our commentary position here in Leisureland. Mosquera dips low. He Uses tries the to head, pushing him back onto the ropes. Pushing him back onto yeah. the ropes. Malloy works inside. Mosquera is taken away. He'll get a speaking. He'll be talked to by the referee. Mosquera smiles. Malloy comes forward, stalking his prey. A good shot from Mosquera, retaliation, a beautiful left uppercut from Kieran Malloy. Malloy finding his range once again in round number three. Fernando Mosquera. 
Gloves held high, back down to the ropes, right above us here. And Malloy, with venom in his eyes, goes to work above Mascara, oh, right above our coming position He felt that one under the left rib there. Yes, indeed, Mascara yeah, really got us. him. Right above us here, Kieran Malloy, a beautiful shot to the rib cage of Fernando Mascara. Mascara holding on, the referee splits them away, and they move back again, and Malloy resumes his business in the middle of the, the ring. With the Bar 7 logo on the back of his togs. Kieran Malloy goes forward. The shouts of come on, Kieran, come from our left hand side. People from all parts of the world, and certainly the parts of County Galway and beyond, are here to see this scrap. And Malloy has given them what they wanted to see so far. In this, the third round, a beautiful left hand to the jaw of Mosquera. It was a long left hand, but it certainly hit its target. Oh, it's as did that right to the ribs. And Malloy now here in round number three, finding his range. Right in Mosquera's corner. Malloy goes in. Mosquera covers up. And Malloy once again he left right in combination. A swipe from Mosquera. Mosquera yeah. looks at him, he grimaces, he fixes his togs. He looks, he says to Malloy, come on, see what you've got. Malloy will come back once more. That's South Paul lead from the man from up to The body is sore though, George. The body is sore. He's, across across his arms across he's his saying it's a low blow, the referee may yeah. agree, but then Mosquera is dipping low, that's what's forcing that. Malloy, the right lead. As we move into two minutes and 20 seconds of round number three here in Leisureland. Kieran Malloy from Uktarard against Fernando Mosquera from Colombia at welterweight, the fifth professional bout of Malloy's career, who had a wonderful amateur career, one of the most el- finest elite boxers we've seen in this country for many a day, and certainly joining some of the greats from the west of Ireland. The Sean Mannions of this world, the Aidan and Michael John Heffernan's, the Marchie knees back in the day. Goes back of ours, Francie Barrett, who proudly carried the flag for Ireland in the Olympics. Malloy again, tangled up, Mosquera comes forward. A good left hand from, Mal- from Malloy, lands onto the chin of Mosquera. Mosquera is getting a bit braver now in this round. He's coming out of his shell, but Malloy wraps him up. Mosquera holds on, wraps up Malloy. Malloy doesn't want this, he wants it at the end of round number three. Another good round for Kieran Malloy, Sean. You see him lifting the, 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 the race. The referee calls yeah. him together for round number four, and we get underway. At welterweight here in Leisureland in this Conlon Boxing and top rank promotion. Kieran Malloy from Uktarard in Galway here. Southpaw stance as he's had throughout his career, leading the orthodox style of Fernando Mosquera. Back side of the ropes over in the corner, occupied by Kieran Malloy's t- backroom team. And Mosquera's uh, switched to Southpaw now as he well. Has, he's yeah. switching out. Is that a sign maybe that he's finding it double, tough, to diffi- difficult, Sean? Maybe to he took too Malloy. much on the left, so I'd like to yes, go for the right. Possibly, <laughs> yes. And Malloy, a beautiful yeah. right hand that landed on the jaw of, of Fernando Mosquera. Mosquera comes forward and holds on. He's Malo- back to orthodox again now. He's back, he is, and Malloy is coming forward. The crowd singing all ALA behind us as Malloy comes forward, stalks his opponent. His opponent ducks, almost goes down on one knee as he tries to get inside a right from Kieran Malloy. Kieran Malloy with a left uppercut that again shook Mosquera's ribcage. Mosquera tempting Malloy onto him. The small squat style of Mosquera. Malloy opens up with two. A combination, a left-right combination towards the rib cage of Fernando Mosquera. Malloy enjoying a reach advantage over the dominion of Colombia. But Colombia goes forward, he walks onto a right hand from Kieran Malloy that just about glanced onto the jaw of Fernando Mosquera. He's definitely trying to avoid those body shots it's in there. Deep in the, we're coming, he certainly is, Sean, as yeah, we approach yeah. the halfway mark in this round. Kieran Malloy. Top billing. In all his fifth professional fight here in his home city of Galway. Lands a left, a beautiful left hand under the jaw for Fernando Mosquera. about the back of the head, Mosquera. Corus complaining about the back of the head. I don't know what he's complaining about. He comes forward with a couple of punches on his own. Malloy takes somebody stride. Malloy lands a right under the face of, of Fernando Mosquera. He lands another right, right above a commentary, commentary position here in Leisureland. A good shot from Mosquera. A bit fresh air, but he turns away again. He turns his back. He dances away. He moves over towards the corner occupied by the Malloy contingent. Center of the ring, Kieran Malloy against Fernando Mosquera. Fourth round of schedule late here in Leisureland and Salt Hill in Galway. Yeah, a beautiful left pass. hand from Kieran Malloy. Lands right on and that rocked the Colombian. A left uppercut from Malloy that has put the Colombian back in. He waves his hands to say, You're not hurting me. My God Almighty, you're a good actor, Mr. Mosquera. Malloy again comes forward, pushes him onto the ropes over toward the neutral corner. Mosquera comes forward with a right hand of his own. Malloy takes it in his stride, oh, a, a beautiful right hook right to the chin of Fernando Mosquero. Mosquero is holding on again as we approach 2 minutes 40 seconds in round number 4 here in Leisureland. 
Mosquera squats again as Malloy goes and leads with a beautiful left hand from Malloy. Didn't quite hit the target, but it was almost there. A right hand comes over the top and hit Mosquera. Mosquera ties up Malloy as we're deep into the throws of the final seconds of round number four, Sean Clancy. Another good round from Kieran Malloy. Yeah, and in fairness in that round, Mosquera, he's not offering anything now in relation to turning punches. He's more interested about protecting himself, moving around, coming off the is. The referee is calling boxers to the centre of the ring as we start round number seven, or round number five of the schedule eight. As right in front of us here, Kieran Malloy leads with two rights to the jaw area of Fernando Mosquera. Mosquera ducks and dives and moves in front of us here and goes into that neutral corner. It's above us, a beautiful combination oh, no, of Kieran Malloy right over the top of the left uppercut. Another straight left that lands under the jaw of Mosquera. Malloy with intent in his face now as we look at up into the ring. Malloy carrying out Mosquera with oh, a beautiful shot of his own. Punch. But Malloy caught him over, a beautiful shot from Malloy that put back Mosquera right above us here. In Legend, an absolutely jam packed Legendland here on this Condon Boxing and Top Rank Billing. Top of the bill, Kieran Malloy from Uktarard against Fernando Mosquera from Colombia. He's gone southpaw again now into the southpaw stand. He's gone Mosquera. into the southpaw stand, a beautiful right to the ribcage of Mosquera, and that certainly must have hurt and actually nearly hurt us here, Sean, at ringside. But Malloy comes forward once again. Mosquera right over the, above us here. The crowd are chanting. Malloy's corner are urging him on. Mosquera. Dances right in front of us. Kieran Malloy comes right over. Another with body punch. Left body punch. Mosquera co- holds on as we're oh, to the head. Two. Two. A he's rocking hurt. punch. Mosquera is hurt yeah, right in front of us. He's falling forward. He's falling forward. Yeah, he's, he's, he's held on now. He's held on yeah, for dear yeah. life. And Malloy has hit the target. Mosquera looks at him. He smiles. Is that a smile of defence? Or is it a smile that he knows that the clock is ticking on this bomb about him? Because we're deep in the fifth round. We're a minute and 25 seconds into it. And Kieran Malloy from Uktarard here in Galway with a perfect record of 4-0 and zero as a professional comes forward hits McQuarrie oh through. that was a hard body punch it certainly was he bent the knee there he did bent the knee he bent more than the knee I thought he, the man was genuflecting <laughs> we come and Malloy comes forward Mosquera now showing the scars of battle in this round oh, a beautiful shot by Malloy no no no, no. Mosquera says it was, it was a low blow he said it was a low oh. blow he dropped his hands you're supposed to protect yourself at all times Malloy hit him, he's getting the count now. He certainly is getting the count, he's yeah. getting a standing eight count. The referee is asking him, is he good enough to continue? Kieran Malloy in f- fifth round here in Legendland. The crowd have gone into overdrive. As Kieran Malloy comes forward against Fernando Mosquera from Colombia. He's holding on, he's holding, he's holding, he's holding on. Mosquera is holding on for dear life for two minutes and 12 seconds into the fifth round, Sean. And Kieran Malloy, by far, this is his most productive round of the contest. Absolutely, yeah, and you know, um, the power punches started from the very they start of this round. And another beautiful right hand there lands on the jaw of Fernando Mosquera. He's backed into his own corner, a left uppercut from Malloy. Deep into the throws of two minutes and 31 seconds in round number five. Kieran Malloy at welterweight. His fifth professional fight, a perfective professional record of four and zero. He has oh, Mosquera no, in his an absolutely beautiful and he uppercut. Again. Mosquera is getting, he's looking at the referee, he's complaining what he's complaining about. I do not know about Mosquera. He has to be given credit. He's very game. He's standing up to the best. Malloy has thrown at him. And now the left hand lands in the face of Fernando Mosquera. He's grimacing. He's wondering, can he last another four seconds? A beautiful right hand with Malloy at the end of the fifth round. And the bell will toll at the end of this fifth round. And will tell us that Kieran Malloy has by far put in his most productive round of boxing here in Legend and Agoba, Absolutely, George. And you said about Mosquera's amateur career. Only he's time will tell. As the referee calls the gladiators to the centre of the ring. And Kieran Malloy starts on the attack with a right-left combination. As Fernando Mosquera, right above us here, comes forward, head bowed, onto Malloy's way, he lands a punch, a beautiful left uppercut from Kieran Malloy. Well, Square comes over the top of the right hand, but Malloy deflects that away with his left hand. Very a sweeping left hand from K- Kieran Malloy, a right to the face of Mosquera that's backed over in the neutral corner on the far side of the ring. Malloy sets him out into the ribcage, Mosquera holds on, slaps Malloy at the back of his ribs, He's looking at the referee, he's looking at Malloy. Kieran Malloy, a beautiful oh. uppercut shot. One, two, uppercut. Lands in the face, another beautiful left hand from Kieran Malloy. Mosquera back in his own corner, and left, left uppercut. This, it has to be said, is a great rear action from, from Mosquera. But Malloy has landed a beautiful left hand shot over the neutral corner. Mosquera comes forward and he holds on for dear life in the centre of the ring. We're 53 seconds into the sixth of eight rounds. He's taken some heavy punches. He certainly has. The crowd shout, Kieran, Kieran, Kieran. A beautiful left hand from Malloy. He's answering the crowd's call. Round number six, we're one minute and five seconds into it. And Malloy comes forward right above us here in our commentary position at the Leisureland in association with Conlon Boxing and Top Rank Promotions. Kieran Malloy with a left hand to the face of Fernando Mosquera. Mosquera bends again in front of us. 
holds on for dear life. We're a minute and 20 seconds into the round. Once again, Malloy, unfazed, lands a right hand on the side of the face of Fernando Mosquera. Mosquera lands a right of his own, it's a good shot, but Malloy returns with a left uppercut. Mosquera holds on, and Malloy hits him with a beautiful right hand right above us. He's right above us here in our commentary position. He backs onto the ropes right in front of us. Sean, Sean Clancy takes a base of action as we come in deep into the sixth round. And we're a minute and 50 seconds into this round on Kieran Malloy. Referee David Irwin hasn't had much to deal with in this contest. Both boxers are respecting his control. Mosquera smiles at Malloy as he goes to the body. A beautiful oh, uppercut. And this it could be a great combination. And Malloy comes forward. Mosquera has nothing to answer. Malloy hits him a beautiful line left hand. A beautiful left hand onto the face of Mosquera, who did retaliate with a right of his own. And a, another right to the side of the head of Mosquera. I must say to the ref, right. David Irvine, he's watching it. He's watching it closely. In he certainly is. Yeah, yeah. He certainly is. Malloy swinging a left hand, swinging a right hand. With two minutes and 24 seconds into the sixth of eight rounds. We're over in the neutral corner of Kieran Malloy with a punch. savage left body punch to the ribcage of Fernando oh, Mosquera at that one. to the right. Oh my, my God. God almighty. <laughs> if that fellow was eight and today, he certainly found them there, Malloy. What a wonderful, that's a beautiful, right. beautiful right. Uh, Malloy is now getting huge success to the body of Mosquera. The crowd breaking the song once again here in the sixth round in Leisureland. As Kieran Malloy lands another punch onto the face of Fernando Mosquera. A beautiful left hand from Malloy with a right combination. As we hit the end of round number six, another superb round from Malloy, Sean. Round seven, Absolutely. Beginning of round number seven, as the referee calls the two boxers, their respective rings dry. Some of the crowd on their toes again, urging them on. They certainly are. Maybe the crowd are getting impatient, they wanted it on the stoppage. We're round number seven. But we also must now remember that Kieran Malloy moves into unknown territory. This, even though we're only 15 seconds into round number seven, the furthest he's been as a professional boxer as Mosquera hits with a right of his own. Malloy, unfazed, comes forward, a right-left oh, combination. That's punch. a beautiful right hand from Kieran Malloy. Mosquera pulls out a left hand, doesn't hit the target. Mosquera cover up, that's a tremendous left hand, a right body punch from Malloy. Hurts Mosquera, Mosquera tries to retaliate, two good punches from Mosquera. The best two maybe he's thrown in the fight so far. Malloy replies, a left jab out from Mosquera. Forces Malloy back to the centre of the ring, but Malloy comes forward again with a right hand. The right hand gets through, a beautiful right hand gets to the centre of the face of Fernando Mosquera who dropped his guard. Is he trying to protect his ribs? One wonders, Mosquera charges forward, but in the end, Malloy steps away. A minute into round number seven, number seven of eight. Kieran Malloy from Uchtenard and formerly of Uchtenard Boxing Club in the outskirts of Galway City, just 12 miles outside the city of Galway. Versus Fernando Mosquera. Malloy, a wonderful savage left up. He's He's the the of a low blow. He's referee is is the referee is the knows that it was not a low blow, it was low into the ribcage. What it was, was on target. The referee, David Irwin, separates the boxes. Right in front of us here. A left good right hand from Mosquera, but Malloy slips away. A minute 37 into the round of seven. Seven rounds of eight as Malloy goes to work again in the body, tries to go around the back of Mosquera. Mosquera tries to throw a right of his own, but he is now more and more Sean beginning to hold on to Kieran Malloy. Yeah, you know, he, he is getting tired. Around. That's a beautiful shot from Malloy. It's getting harder for him to move away, George. It is, it is. The crowd singing. Rock concerts were the norm here in Leisureland many years ago. They're doing their best to reincarnate the likes of Tin Lizzy and status quo on YouTube. Kieran Malloy. Mosquera holding on. You've got to give him credit. He certainly came here to cause Malloy a bit of problems. Doing his best to frustrate the up the road man. But Malloy is calm. CCC. Cool, calm and collected for Malloy so far as we reach two minutes and 25 seconds in round number seven. Round seven of eight at the top of the build clash here in Leisureland in this boxing bill brought to you by Conlon Boxing, top rank promotions, ESPN and Bar 7 in Galway and live commentary on Galway BFM throughout the world on gbfm.ie. Again, just tying up Kieran there again on the yes. ropes. As we reach the final 20 seconds of round number seven, Mosquera came forward, Malloy. Takes the best he's had. Malloy goes inside with a left hand. Mosquera tries. What he's trying really is he's trying to just push him away. Malloy hits again. A beautiful shot from Malloy. Mosquera came forward with a right of his own. And a lower right of his own, but it doesn't land. It lands onto the arm of Kieran Malloy as we hit the final seconds of round oh. number seven. An absolute cracker into the ribcage again of Malloy. 
as we reach the final stages of round number seven. Galloy coming forward. He's Good pushing out here now, Mascara. He's pushing out here out of the mouth there after the last Oh, one. right in his own corner. Yeah. Kieran Malloy lands a sucker punch right at the end. And the walk of Fernando Mascara back to his corner on our leg. You know, the Malloy family said they'd bring boxing back to Galway. As the referee brings them together. They touch gloves for the eighth and final round of the top of the mill clash between the welterweight Kieran Malloy of Uctar Ireland County Galway and Fernando Mascara from Colombia, boxing out of Valencia in Spain for the last number of years. Right above us here as Mascara moves away over towards the, the red corner occupied by the backroom team of Kieran Malloy. The crowd starts singing, oh Kieran Malloy. A beautiful left hand that has rocked oh, Mascara yes. right out of the ropes in front of us into the neutral corner. Mascara tries to find his way out of it. He holds on for dear life. Referee David Irwin tells him. Boxers to split. It's Mascara that's holding on. David Irwin knows that. He tells Mascara to come away. And Malloy comes forward again. A clubbing right hand over the top. Mascara though is nothing of that game. And has come here to battle. Kieran Malloy, centre of the ring, an uppercut, a right, Mascara go wobbles, Just but he's still, how, that man's centre of gravity is unbelievable, because how he stayed up after that right from Kieran Malloy is unbelievable. He's hanging on for dear life as we hit the final two minutes of the eighth and final round. Malloy goes forward again and cracks Ties the ribcage once again, with again. Strong arms. but Mascara is very, very upper body strength, Sean, yeah. and he is tying this up. He's determined to survive the eighth round. Yeah, and all credit to him, you know, he, a lesser man would have quit long ago with the punishment he's been taking. He's taken punishment. Yeah. One sure thing. I don't think he'd be doing many press-ups in the morning. <laughs> no, it could be scrambled eggs as well. There'll be nothing solid too much. Uh. No, it's a, but it's, you got to give him credit. Yeah, absolutely. We also got to give credit to Conlon Boxing, top ranked promotions and the Malloy family for bringing this boxing bill to Leisureland here in Galway. As Kieran Malloy comes forward in the final minute and a half of his professional debut in the city of Galway. His fifth career fight so far. He's into the eighth and final round. He's only ever went as far as six. He is undefeated. He's touted as a very, very top prospect by none other than top-ranked organisation. And when they see them fight in Belfast, they knew what they were in. A beautiful oh, left hand. The square has rattled. And that has rattled him out of the ropes. Yeah. And we'll to the final minute of round of eight. Mosquera. You've got to give him credit. He's held on for dear life. Somehow he has stood on his feet. But it's got beautiful right hand by Malloy. Oh, oh my God. Beautiful left hand. Oh, Another one. Mosquera though holds on for dear life. How this man has not gone down, I will never know. But Malloy. Copy another left. Super oh, up, but the last seven punches from Kieran Malloy have been right on the meat. And another clubbing right hand. But Mosquera holds on. We spoke about the ring craft of Morrissey and Conlon early, early on. But certainly this Mosquera has shown them all as well. Beautiful right hand. The Mosquera says at the back of his head, no, sir, you ducked. I'll be an absolute creamer of a left hand. We're into the final 20 seconds of the eighth and final round of this professional bout. The top of the bill fight here in Galway's Rising, brought to you by Conlon Boxing. Ties Bar up seven top ranked promotions of Galway FM Sport as we get live into the final 10 seconds. The people shout clear and there's 10 seconds to go. Mosquera takes a clubbing right hand again. He holds on for dear life. He's going to last the eighth round. He deserves credit for that shot. Absolutely. You know, hats off to him. The bell goes. He's and Kieran Malloy salutes the crowd. The, occasion. the crowd go absolutely wild. And I think they got value for money, Sean. Yeah. The referee calls the gladiators together. Everybody knows, I think, what the decision will be. Absolutely. But I think it'll be what greater a with a massive roar, Sean. Yeah, what a homecoming.